Hi guys, today I'm doing a huge fall haul. I went to Forever 21, MAC, Macy's, Sephora, and Charlotte Ruth. So I'm going to start off with what I got at MAC because I got some new lip products. As you might be able to tell, I am wearing something different on my lips and it's kind of out of my comfort zone. So this is what it looks like. Let me know what you guys think. Ooh, yay or nay. But I am wearing the World Lip Liner, and this is the one that Kylie Jenner wears all the time. And it's really pretty. I just don't know if I can pull it off, so yeah, just let me know what you think. So I got this. Then I got the lipstick that she wears as well. This is in Faux, and it's just a dark nude shade. It's really pretty for fall. And yeah, wearing that as well. And then the last lipstick I got from MAC is Angel, which is a pretty popular one. And this is just a lighter nude shade, which I think is more appropriate for like every day. Again, it's really pretty, and I'm very excited with my purchases from MAC, because I haven't been in so long. But yeah, I don't know. I just keep looking at my lips, because I don't know how I feel. But that's what I got at MAC. Now, moving on, I got one thing at Charlotte Russe. And it's not even really fall-like at all, but oh well, I thought it was really pretty. So I got this light pink and blue kimono. It looks like this, and it has some fringe at the bottom. I thought it was really cute and just like a comfy, relaxing day with some leggings and wearing this. So got this, it was $22.99. And I got a large because they didn't have a small or a medium. Um, let's see. I got the shirt that I'm wearing from Macy's. It has like roses on it. You can't really tell, but it has like rose print on it. And then I also got these pants to go with it. I'm not wearing them right now because I film in my pajamas all the time, bottom half. But I got these pants to go with it. I thought they were really cute and it would be a nice fall outfit together. They're very comfortable as well. Okay, I got one thing from Sephora, and it's a set of Siate London nail polishes. I don't know how to say Siate, but hopefully I'm saying it decently right. So I just got some glitter polishes, and these are really pretty for fall. I haven't painted my nails in like so long because I have a problem with picking my nails. So every time they're like short and stubby, I'm like, ew, I don't want to paint those stubs. But this is what I got from Sephora. Really pretty, and you get to pick your own shade, so I thought that was nice for $18. Okay, moving on to Forever 21. I did some shopping. So, start off with this. I got this Barbie makeup bag, and I thought this would be nice for traveling like to Barbados in a few months. But this just says Barbie, plastic, man-made, living doll. I woke up like this. Yeah, I just thought this was really cute. It's waterproof, it's spacious, and this was $6.90. And it's Barbie. You guys know I love Barbie. All right, next, I got some over-the-knee socks. These are black and gray, and I just want to start wearing over-the-knee socks because I think the trend is really cute, and yeah, that's all I can say. These were $6.80. Then I got the cutest socks. These are donut socks. How cute are these? These were $1.50 and I should have bought like 20 pairs of these because they're so adorable. I love these socks. Teddy will love them too. Then I got this light brownie taupe sweater shirt. It looks like this. I thought it was really cute to wear with like high-waisted jeans, black combat boots. Oh yes, honey. I think it's really cute. I don't know if I can pull off like light brown, but I'm gonna try. So I got this and it was only $6.80. Then I got these maroon burgundy wine, I don't know what you wanna call it, but high-waisted shorts. These are so comfortable and they were pretty inexpensive. They were $11.80 and I surprisingly fit into a small. So I got these. Earrings? Oh my god, I'm so excited. I'm wearing these today. I completely forgot I got earrings. So these are diamond earrings and they're just so sparkly. Oh, 
I am so excited now. I completely forgot I got these. A lot of the times I will buy stuff from Forever 21 and I'll get a pair of earrings, completely forget about it. It will be at the bottom of a bag and then I'll throw the bag out. Like what is life? I always do that. So I'm very excited I just found these. And then I got a sweater. This is a cream sweater. I got a medium, yeah, 1980. And the reason why I got it was because there is lace at the bottom of it. So I thought that was really, really pretty and feminine and I'm very girly, so I will enjoy this. All right, next bag. I got another pair of socks. These are unicorn socks. Again, so adorable. I like the donuts way better, but these are really cute as well. $1.50. Then I got this sweater. It is tan and cream. This is the bottom of it. Here we go. It is a v-neck sweater and it's just very comfortable. It has the buttons and it has the v-neck in the back as well. And yeah, I thought this was really, really cute. And this is a small and 1980. Adorable. Okay, next purchase I am obsessed with on another level. That's it. So it is a Barbie sweater and it is fuzzy and it has the little stripes on the sleeves. And I love these fuzzy sweaters for the fall and winter just because they're so cozy and warm and comfortable. And this one's light pink and it says Barbie so it's pretty much perfection. I love it. I love it so much. So I got this, and this was $24.90. And then I got a couple of bottoms. I got this plaid skirt from Forever 21 just because I feel like plaid is in right now. And I think it's cute to have a little plaid skirt. So I got this, and this was $17.80. So cute! And then the last thing I got were these pair of shorts. They are plaid and they're like a lighter material with the black lace coming out of the bottom. These were $13.80 and I thought this would be cute with black, black tights, combat boots, and a black sweater. Oh yes, so I got these. And that was everything I got in my fall haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. I don't think I will be doing any more fall shopping just because Ugh, I don't really like fall or winter very much. I'm just more of a spring and summer and warm person. But, I don't know. You never know. Maybe I'll need more things, but uh, probably, no. I'll probably stop. <laughs> okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!